This is Living Health TV. Welcome to Health 101 with me, Dr. Benga Adebayo. Brought to you by Living Health International, your number one health and wellness solution company. Today we want to look at a problem that is all around us. A big problem that a lot of people are not paying attention to. And in fact, you might be one of the people guilty of this offense. Today, we want to look at antibiotic abuse antibiotic abuse. Many years ago, while I was still working in the hospital, somebody walked into my consulting room and looked at me and said, Doctor, I'm not feeling fine. I said, okay, okay, that's good. You're not feeling fine. What is wrong with you? He said, Doctor, Doctor, you, you don't understand. You cannot understand. I, I have severe malaria. I said, okay, that's okay. We can treat that. I will give you so, so, and so. He said, Doctor, no, 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 no. I don't want that. The malaria is serious. I want you to give me ciprofloxacin. And I looked at him and understood this guy does not know what he's talking about. The guy was celebrating his ignorance. He was happy in his ignorance. No, that is not what we do for malaria. And that is what many people do. They have headache, is an antibiotic. They have mouth pain, is an antibiotic. Their throat just started paining them yesterday, is an antibiotic they want. They are running stool, is an antibiotic that they want. That is a dangerous habit. Antibiotics have become so abused that we are running into an issue. We are running into problems such that we have some infections now in the world that antibiotics are not amenable to treat anymore, simply because people have continuously abused these antibiotics. Let me tell you what happens. When you continue to use antibiotics that you should not use, when you continually use them, what is going to happen is that the pathogens, the germs that you have in your system, after a while, can get used to those drugs such that when you need that antibiotic, it is no longer useful for you. So please, stop abusing antibiotics. What are the things that you should do? Don't use an antibiotic unless a doctor prescribes it for you. Don't. And should a doctor prescribe an antibiotic for you, if he says to you, use it for five days, please do use it for five days. Don't feel better on day three, and then stop using the antibiotic. Because what is going to happen is that that infection may resurge, and those pathogens may no longer be susceptible for the common drug or the drug that we use for you. You will need to go to another level, go to another level, and there is a limit on the pipeline of antibiotics that we have. Please share this message with someone. Subscribe to this channel. Please make sure you do so. And I want to ask you a question. When last did you use an antibiotic? And did you use it as you should? You can connect with me on Twitter at Dr. Adebayo, at Dr. Adebayo. God bless you. Thank you. Remember your health is your end. God bless you.